Hey guys, now that you've done this uh, Southern Colonies GRE passage and you've analyzed it, you've gotten the questions right, you've understood the subtleties, we're actually going to look at it again. And this time, we're going to look at the grammar. And I know you're wondering basically this, why on earth are we looking at the grammar? Isn't grammar just some silly stuff that you, know, you kind of have to learn and then immediately forget about in school? Why does grammar matter? Well, actually, grammar is much more important and much more useful than most people realize. If you watch the way that little kids read, they read each word one letter at a time. And it takes them like four hours to get through a sentence. By the time they've gotten to the end of the sentence, they have always forgotten the beginning of the sentence. So not only do they read really slow, they just have no idea what they're reading ever. Interestingly, adults do something very similar. Instead of reading one letter at a time, they read one word at a time, which works on things that are really, really simplistic. But if they read anything complicated, they mostly just get confused. They forget what they are reading. By the time they get to the end of a page of complex text, they forgot text, they've forgotten the beginning of it. What we want to teach you how to do here at Vora Method is to group things grammatically and understand how these grammatical things work together. That is a skill that's difficult to learn. Realistically, it's difficult to learn, but the payoff is enormous. Just like you read, think about how much faster you read now because you don't read one letter at a time because you read one word at a time. You can have a similar quantum increase in your reading speed and accuracy if you learn to read grammatically. Most adults cannot read grammatically. Very few can. Those who can read many times faster than other people. Listen, when I was taking the GRE, I finished the GRE about an hour and 45 minutes early. And part of it is, yeah, I do the math really quick, but the entire math section is only an hour and 30 minutes long. I couldn't have finished it just that fast because I was so good at math. It's also because I was reading in a way that is dramatically different from the way that most other adults read. And that's what I want to teach you guys how to do. That's what this worksheet is about. It's teaching you how to read faster. It's teaching you how to read more accurately by understanding these word groupings and how they work together. This worksheet is it's going to be weird for a lot of you guys. It might be the first time you've ever really seen rigorous grammar, but I promise you, if you get good at using grammar, you are going to be able to read faster and more accurately. So go ahead and let's get started with this grammar worksheet.